Coven here. We've been going around interviewing people from Piedmont Avenue in Pensacola, Florida, where there's been, as you can see, quite a bit of destruction that has taken place because of the amount of water. We received in the last 24 hours 27 inches of water, of rain, came down. That, coupled with a main line bursting, has caused some enormous, enormous pollution. Now, of the people that we interviewed, we asked them, what do you think caused all this erosion? Do you think it was a lot of time or a lot of water? Here's what they say. You live in the Pensacola area? Yes. Have you ever seen any damage like this before here? Well, a little bit during Ivan, yeah. Have you ever experienced anything like this before? No. I, Ivan was similar, but that was tree damage. This is unbelievable. This is a disaster. Mark and Adam, you guys live around here? Yes, yeah, sir. We do. You ever seen anything like this before? No. Have you guys uh, ever seen anything like this before? No, sir, I've not. What do you think caused all this? Was it the amount of time or the amount of water? The amount of water because it rained so long. What do you think caused all the disaster? Was it the amount of time or the amount of water? Well, this is obviously water. It's a powerful force. Water. 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 The amount of water. You guys are all sure on that. This is unanimous? Yes. Yeah. I, I think it's the water. I mean, just the impact that it came through with. Um, a lot of water in a short amount of time just flow in fastly, just eroded everything. Now, I got a scientific question for you. What do you think caused all the erosion that's taking place behind you? Do you think it was the amount of time or the amount of water? It was the amount of water. What do you think? Time. Time? How long did this take to erode away? How long did that take? Like, the, when the water came? Or yeah. Like 15 to 30 minutes, like an hour. Oh, 15 to 30 minutes. So I'm going to ask you again. What do you think took, what do you think really caused all this erosion? Was the amount of time or the amount of water that caused it? The water. I I think it's about a water. Yeah, we have never, we've so. never seen this much, much water ever. I would it's think water. Yeah, or both. How long did it take to erode this street out? No. Probably last night. I think it was just overnight, and it all started going down. So let me ask you again: Was it the amount of time, or was it the amount of water? What do you think? Probably definitely the amount of water. I would say water. Uh, definitely the amount of water. It's just so much in such a short period of time. I don't see how anything else could have caused it. I believe it's a lot of time, uh, the rain, a lot of a lot of water coming down. It was like all night since. Ben, uh, have you ever seen anything like this before? I, I've uh, I've witnessed things like this in the Grand Canyon and things before. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, oh, that's cool. Not, not here in Pensacola. I've never seen anything. It's quite like an there. erosion feature. Uh, it is. What do you think caused this? Is it the amount of uh, water or time, or what it's, caused all this? It's clear. It is clear because uh, I actually live on this road, further down that way, not in the hole, thankfully. And it's clear because I drive on this road every day that that took millions of years. I mean, it's clear to me. I was driving down this road yesterday. There was nothing. And then today, it's gone. So it took millions of years, no that, doubt. You're it's sure clear. about that? I'm 100% sure. It had to have been. So the evidence is incredibly clear to you? The, the, uh, the evidence is irrelevant. I believe that it took millions of years. I may have driven on here a few days ago, but I'm telling you, it took millions of years. It had to have. It's, it's, there's not a doubt in my mind. So have you learned anything about some moving water? It destroys anything. I mean, whatever is in its way. It's obvious to anyone that this erosion was caused not by a lot of time, but by lots and lots of water running through here. I mean, I'm standing a good four to four and a half feet below where the street level used to be. And it's not because of millions of years. It's because of the amount of water that came through here. Just like when we look at the erosion features all around the earth, like the Grand Canyon, it's not the result of millions of years and a little bit of water. It's the result of a whole lot of water, a global flood, and a little bit of time. Please keep that in mind when you look around at evidence. Pensacolians see this evidence and they know the truth. I hope you'll believe it too.